All right, hello, and welcome to Car Mechanic Simulator. As you guys know, I'm a huge fan of simulator games, and uh, this is one that I really enjoy playing. We're a little bit of ways through on this one, actually, in our garage. You can see we got $20,000 already up there and some XP points and stuff like that. But I really wanted to get back into this and kind of just dip the toes in and, you know, see if this was something you guys wanted to see more of. So this is the shop so far, what we have. We're going to grab a job here and just kind of get right back into the swing of things in the shop. So let's let's see what they have for us so far on the... On the old, on the old ring of phone here. A royal crown. <clears throat> this has got transmission issues. I don't know if I want something like that quite to start off with. Maybe we'll start off with something easy like this here. Brake system needs fixing. Loud when accelerating. List provided. Okay, so probably looks like it maybe needs some brakes and possibly a muffler. Why don't we go ahead and take this one to start with. An Olsen Grand Club. We'll go ahead and start with that. Alright. <clears throat> there it is in the shop. Oh, man. She is a rusty old girl. Ooh, what have they done to you, girl? Oh, man. Okay. Um, so, we we're looking at brakes and a... How can I... Okay, the first thing we're going to do with you is put you on the hoist. Because I can't look at the brakes and stuff if it's sitting here. So I want to move you to the lift. Here we are. Alright. We'll see. We'll make sure the braking system's okay. Under here. I don't know if it gets that... Oh yeah, it does get that complex. Here's the... There's braking stuff. This brake system here. Uh, so I can hold this to focus on the part. Um, that removed the part. Okay, no, we want to put this back on now. <laughs> yeah, this one. There you go. <clears throat> okay, so I mean... Isn't there a way that we could... Examine mode, here we go. So yeah, okay, so this is green, it's good. We're happy with that. I wanna make sure that first off the bat that this was okay. And I mean showing it at 80 81% shows us that it's good. So we can get out of there and we'll lift this thing up and just check out underneath here. Uh we wanna go all the way. Are we still in examination mode? That I don't know. Uh, condition, we don't know that yet. But we want to know the condition of the muffler because I know it was part of the issue. So actually the muffler is in good condition. Seventy-four percent. That that's okay. We can work with that. <clears throat> All right. This is where our issue lies, right here. So we're gonna take that off, and then we'll have to just order a new piece to go there and that should fix our muffler issue this side too looks really bad this thing has dual exhaust damn all right so we know we need some muffler parts we'll get that out of the way first and then we'll tackle these brakes exhaust Showing first, let's look at our parts list and see of inventory. Okay, so these are the ones we pulled off. And they're just that. We know which ones those are. Alright, we'll go ahead and order those. Uh, I can just press T now because I have the tablet, which is nice. <clears throat> and that's two of these, so we're going to need two. 
114 bucks. Not a problem. All right, we'll snap those back on. Start mount this guy. Yes, we want that one. And you there. We want that one. No clamps, no nothing. Just slip in parts, I guess. I would say that this muffler probably needs repaired too. Um, and we can go into... We can go into examination mode here. And yeah, you can see right there that it is indeed toast. All right, we're gonna go ahead and get one of those two rear muffler V8. T, we'll bring that up. Exhaust, and it should be right. It should be in here. Rear muffler V8. That would be this one. It didn't specify if it was a B or not, did it? <clears throat> no, it wasn't a B. Okay, good. Good, good, good. Alright, we'll order that up. And it will magically appear right in our pocket. This one here, 300. Oh, 285. Do I get a discount? Or are they taking like a core on the other one? I don't know, but I'll take it. Go ahead and install that back on there with the good one. Boom, look at that. Beautiful. You're going to be quiet as a kitten. A purring kitten, I should say. All right. <clears throat> I think that's going to take care of our exhaust issues that the customer was having and we're just going to move right on to the brakes now because we know that's a problem for sure all right from what i can see Rule of thumb with this game, anything that's rusted like this is, is probably going to be a big issue. Uh, I'll go into examination mode anyways, but I can probably tell you for sure that this caliber is dunzo. Pads, what are our pads at? 68%, that's actually pretty good, so we'll probably we'll leave those pads alone. What's our rotors looking like? 79%, I'm happy with that. Okay, we'll move around over to the other side. I kind of want to get a, a list of everything I need before I start getting too deep into everything, you know? Oh, wow. <clears throat> okay. Just make sure we're in examination mode. Definitely going to need a rotor on this side. Actually, 63%. That's pretty good. I was actually surprised by the amount of rust that was on there. I guess that's not always a factor. So, two calipers on the front, as far as I can tell. And we'll check the backs real quick to make sure that they're going to be good. Mm, everything back here actually doesn't look too bad. We may as well go ahead and check it all, right? Because we don't want to send this thing out. There's something wrong. We're good on this side. I imagine the other side is going to be as well. Hmm. 
Whoop. Ooh, we got some pads on this side that need replaced. Now, normally, in real life, you would do pads on both sides, not just one side, but this game is uh, a little bit off of real life. So we're going to need a set of rear pads and two front calipers for the braking system. So let's go ahead and order that stuff. Actually, first thing we're going to do <coughs> is pull these off because... I need to make sure I order the correct ones. So there's our front caliper, one of them. Our second caliper. And we'll sneak around over to the back here and grab these, these pads that are on here. take these. Alright. Two calipers. Two front calipers. Uh, let's look at our inventory first and make sure that we're ordering the right parts. Here's one. And this is the other one here. So they're just your standard brake caliper. 4% each on those bad boys. I could replace one of them to save them some cost with one I have. But. I don't really want to give the customer my used parts. They didn't specify that I could use used parts. So I'll order brand new. And the brake pads are just standard brake pads. So two calipers, brake pad. We already know that. Two of you. And a set of pads. All right. <clears throat> and we're going to go apart mount. We want to mount you. And you. Throw the rim back on. We'll sneak over here and get this side going. That's the one, that's the one. Uh, this side is actually good, so we can button this side up. Oop. Oh, that sounded like Silent Hill. Beautiful. <clears throat> this guy's gonna be ready to tackle any type of adventure he needs. Safely. Put these pads on. Caliper. Uh, I don't know if this one was his or this one, but we'll give him this one. All right, I think we're good. Now, in real life, you know, you'd have to bleed the brake system and pump the brakes and get the air out of the lines and whatnot, but I, uh, I really don't think that's something we have to do here. No, no. <clears throat> I think 
do I have to hold it to get to get the car all the way down? Yeah. There we go. Um, okay. So now to finish the job, do we go here? No, that takes us another order. We don't want that. We want to complete the job. Parts notes, tablet. Overview mode, move car, simple interior, car status. Oh, here we go. Yeah. Brake caliber, brake caliber. Oh, so, oh, I see. This is cool. So I can, I haven't played this in so long. I've forgotten. I can go into this and uh, it'll have a list of the parts that need to be fixed right here. So I actually diagnosed all that on my own, but this will tell me if I need to find out. So here we can finish our order for this episode and we're going to do that. Boom, another successful client has come and gone at the garage of J, I guess. All right, well, thanks everyone for hanging out for this episode. And uh, I hope you guys enjoy this. If you do, give it a thumbs up and uh, we'll, we'll try and put some more of this out there. I, I really enjoy playing this and I hope you guys like seeing it. So I look forward to seeing you on the next one. Take care and have a good day.